The community is dealing with a devastating loss. A dedicated sheriff's deputy killed in a head-on crash early this morning at the hands of another driver. He served as a school resource officer and trained local law enforcement, and so many are trying to come to terms with what happened. 10 News reporter Lindsay Kennett tells us how Sergeant Perry Hodge is being remembered. Shattered glass, broken plastic, and a growing memorial off Route 11 in Pulaski County. This is where 10-year-old Caden Duncan has to say goodbye to an old friend, Sergeant Perry Hodge. Me and him were very close together, and I knew him for a long time, like my whole life. Laying flowers where Hodge took his last breaths. State police say Hodge, a deputy with the Pulaski County Sheriff's Office, was killed in a car crash, hit by a driver head-on who crossed the median just after 4 a.m. Thursday morning. Caden's mom, who also works for the department, answered the 911 call. She is a 911 dispatcher, and she took the call, and she told me about it this morning. Caden's a fifth grader at Riverlawn Elementary, where Hodge worked as a school resource officer, never without a smile on his face. Him waving at us every morning, get me out of my car every morning. In a statement to 10 News, Pulaski County Public School Superintendent Dr. Kevin Sears says they've made additional counselors available for students and staff. Sergeant Hodge was an excellent school resource officer, and his loss leaves a huge void. The Pulaski County Sheriff's Office posted a tribute on Facebook, writing in part, Sergeant Hodge was a very dedicated public servant with over 15 years of loyal service to the citizens of Pulaski County. Please keep his family in your thoughts and prayers. Caden says he'll remember Sergeant Hodge for the good times. He'd um, give me a sticker every now and then and give me a high five when I was walking down the hallway and wants others to do the same. I just hope y'all remember him as a really good person. In Pulaski County, Lindsay Kennett, 10 News, working for you. Hmm. According to uh, state police, the other driver is in the hospital with serious injuries and charges are pending.